Hello YouTube, I uh, just want to do a review on this uh, water test testing kit. Uh, it is by a company uh, by the name of Hatch, H-A-C-H. Uh, this is for, well this is called the uh, AquaCheck 7. Um, I think the 7 means that it tests the water in 7 different ways or something like that. Anyhow, um, yeah, this is what I use for my pool. Um, it works great, and uh, it tests the water um, for all these uh, seven uh, metrics, I guess, as you can see here. So, um, I just already dipped the uh, the test strip uh, into the pool and. came up with that particular reading and uh, I'm going to show you how to read this properly so starting with the top part um, this particular part right here which is the sorry I'm doing this by myself and it's really hard to hold the bottle and the phone at the same time so this is my total hardness and uh, so all you have to do is just match it to the first section so if you hold the uh, the strip here um, alongside you can then match the uh, the total hardness and it looks like the closest match for this color is somewhere between here and here and uh, again this is for the total hardness uh, ppm i think starts uh, stands for part per million so my total hardness seems to be okay now the second matrix is for total chlorine and my total chlorine is somewhere uh, not too good. It's probably about here I would say, somewhere between here and here. So I would need more chlorine added to the pool. Um, the third matrix is free chlorine and uh, for free chlorine, let me see, the third one. Um, I am actually very low on that and uh, so I need to add chlorine also to make it okay to be at the at the, about this color and then pH um, pH I am right about here here actually I'm a bit high so I need to add uh, muriatic acid to uh, balance out the pH and um, for those of you that uh, may be wondering where you can get muriatic acid, you can actually get it from Home Depot. Um, total alkalinity, um, you can see that uh, I am actually okay on that one. And um, I believe uh, this is also can be taken care of by adding uh, muriatic acid. And then the final last metrics is cyanuric acid and I just looked it up um, what this is cyanuric acid seems to be a chlorine stabilizer or it helps um, these uh, indicators right here the chlorine uh, so if you have uh, not enough chlorine or putting too much chlorine kind of like my situation um, adding cyanuric acid will help so that you don't have to spend so much on chlorine or put so much chlorine and it helps stabilize it or it helps the potency of it. Thank you for watching. That concludes my video for the review of Hatch AquaCheck 7. Uh, please click on the like button and subscribe uh, for more videos about cars or electric cars. Um, home repair things, and uh, electronic reviews. Thank you. Bye-bye.